what's up? So, um, I haven't really vlogged in a while, at least I'm pretty sure. Um, I think mostly just because of, I don't know why actually, exactly. I think it was just a combination of the whole I thing, and then like, um, <clears throat> today's midterm, and the, um, and the, like the other project, and like the combination of those things just made me just, mm, I don't know, not motivated for a lot of things. Um, I just wasn't feeling particularly creative, with the exception of writing, which is what I always wanted to be doing, but I couldn't because I had this stuff to do, which is what I'm supposed to be doing right now. I'll start soon. Okay, wait, hold on. Look, I, I will turn to the page and, like, look at the problems I'm supposed to be doing right now, just for you. Uh, 345... I, I wasn't wearing my hat like this all day, by the way. I just decided to do it just now. I don't know why. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Three, six, nine, and ten. Suppose the United States is at full employment. Then the federal government cuts taxes and all other influences on aggregate demand remain the same. Explain the effect of tax cut on aggregate demand in the short run. Use the following information to do... Okay, well, I'm not doing those problems. Um, six. Table 1 sets up aggregate demand and aggregate supply schedules in Japan. Potential GDP is at 600 trillion yen. What is the short-run macroeconomic equilibrium? Does Japan have an inflationary gap or a recessionary gap, and what is the magnitude? And then nine... Explain the effect of the government's increased expenditure on infrastructure in the U.S. aggregate demand and aggregate supply. And then lastly, the United States in 2011 has a recessionary gap. Use the ASAD model to show the effect on U.S. real GDP as the new infrastructure is completed. Oh wow, it just occurred to me you probably saw nothing but hair. I didn't realize. Okay, well, okay, don't judge me. I haven't vlogged in a while, so I'm, like, rusty, okay? Shut up. Um, okay, so those are more, like, actual, like, do the reading and then answer the questions. I was expecting something more mathy, because that's usually what I have to do in macro. <sighs> okay, well, um, I'm going to do that, and... I'm, I'm going to make a more interesting vlog this week. I know I always say that, but it's true. Um, I'm going to make an effort to make an interesting vlog. Just because I feel like this one's super boring. And I haven't vlogged in a while. I, I had this phase of just doing way too many vlogs. And then this week of, like, no vlogs. Um, I haven't come up with a question yet. But I'll come up with... I can't speak. I will come up with a question for my next vlog. Um, if you don't beat me to vlogging and come up with a question. Um, yeah, I'll think of something. Wow, this is like almost four minutes. I'm gonna stop now. I love you. I miss you. And I'll see you eventually. And I love you.